Hey everybody, I'm going to do one of those get ready with me videos. Those are kind of fun. So mine is super simple and there's not much to it. So it won't take long. Hopefully if I don't yak too much. So I, all I do is when I get out of the shower, I just put my Jergens moisturizer lotion all over my body, including my face. And then, um, right now the makeup that I'm using is the L'Oreal visible lift. I like this one. The color is 146, um, which is nude beige. It seems to work okay. I like L'Oreal Visible Lift. I like Maybelline Fit Me. That's a nice one. This is just what I have right now. I don't really care too much about what I use on foundation because I just like to get it with a coupon and extra bucks or plenty points or whatever. So this is what I'm using today. And I just put it on my hand like that. And then I just start putting it on. So today, me and Mama are going to get our toenails done. And we're going to go to the thrift store because I have a I have two coupons uh, for 50% off one item. So she can get an item and I can get an item. And hopefully... We won't find 12 items that we want to get that we can't live without. But sometimes that happens. Sometimes when we have a 50% off one item, we don't find nothing. So I just put my foundation on. And that's about it. And sometimes I put it... If I remember to put it on my eyelids, I will put it on my eyelids. But sometimes I forget. I mean, I should probably use that under eye concealer because I do have luggage under my eyes, but whatever. It is what it is, which of course it is what it is because it sure ain't what it ain't. So, yeah. So, there. That's that. Foundation not is on. I uh, If I do do the Fit Me, I like the moisturizing one because... Now that I'm older, I need some moisturization going on in my skin, especially in the winter time here in California. It's very dry air, so I need that. So I just have this tiny bit of blush. It's really light. It's one of those things we got free. It's 104. It's light. And I just barely put some on. Sometimes I don't even, and that's okay. Just like, just a little tiny bit. I've got to put on my chin because, you know, I don't want anybody missing this chin. So there's that. Then I'm going to put a little bit of eyeliner on under my eyes. This may not work here. I may have to do the mirror. So, you know, I don't know if you can still see me when I'm doing this, but just a tiny, just a tiny bit. I don't want a lot. And then just a tiny little bit on top. It's daytime, so I don't want to be real out there. If it was nighttime, I'd probably do some more. See, it smudges like crazy. And this is the um, Revlon. I think we got this free when we bought a mascara. We got an eyeliner free or something. And I really like it. The problem is this. It's got this nice little smudgy tip on it, but when you take the lid off to get the smudgy tip, the whole thing comes out. Come on. So you can't even get that thing off. Well, you can, but you got to fight with it. And I'm not into fighting, see? Can't get it off, so the smudgy thing didn't work. So, I just do a tiny little bit up there, just on the corners. Not much. I don't want a lot. I like winged eyeliner. I just can't do it. I might do a little bit today. And then for the eyeshadow, I got this. The Nudes which I thought would be really nice, and some of them are, but most of them are frosty, and I don't like frost on my eyeshadow. I don't think frosting looks good on my eyes. Frosting is better on cakes, not on my eyes, because it gets all crepey in there, because, you know, I do have, you know, uh, crepey kind of eyelids. Plus, I guess I have what they call hooded eyes, only my eyes aren't hooded. They have the whole front end of the car up here. It's every it's the whole front end. It's not just the hood. It's it's the windshield. It's everything is there. So 
So this one was a nice one, this light one, but it's frosty and it has like a pink glow to it and I didn't care for that. So I used this one, the light, the next lightest one, just kind of up here on top. I don't know anything about doing makeup, but I did watch some hooded eye tutorials and stuff, but they, their eyes are nice. They, they barely even have a hooded eye. They don't have the whole front end like me. But so I just do that and then I'm going to do this color because it's a little bit lighter. I don't like a dark so I just do a little tiny bit. And then I go like over here. Like and try to kind of create a crease. I don't really have one but I just kind of try. I don't, and I don't want to take a lot of time here either. Because I don't usually have a lot of time in the morning. Mama's waiting outside for me. I'm sure. I'm sure she's sitting out on her doorstep on the porch waiting. So I sure don't want to take too much time. So just a little bit and on the edge and stuff. Now if it was nighttime, I would use this. I think it was that one that I would use. It's a little bit darker. So I like that one because it's not frosty. Oh wait, I did, this was what I was supposed to use. I use this one and then that one if it's night. Oh well. And I can't half see what I'm doing here. But so I just do a little bit of that, I think. I can't remember. One of them I do. I just do a little bit anyway. No, this one I believe is lighter than that one. Yeah, if it was nighttime, I'd use that one too. But it's too late now. I've already used it, so whatever. Doesn't really matter. And I use these things. I don't use a brush. I have used a brush before, but then I got a then my eye got I got an eye infection. So I don't know if it was the brush or if it was just sometimes. I mean, I have sensitive eyes, so I get eye infections a lot. So well, not really infections. They just hurt sometimes, and I got to take my contacts out and and uh let that go so so there there's that yeah that's good enough and then the mascara that i'm using is just the maybelline great lash we got that free at rite aid so i'm just going to put a little bit of that on um this one is nice too i keep my makeup in there and i know there's probably spots and dirt on it this one's pretty nice the falsies push-up drama but it's really kind of clumpy like but out there so if it was nighttime I'd use that but it's just daytime and we're just going to the thrift store so and get our toenails done so I'll just do this one and it it's nice you can never go wrong with the Maybelline pink and green one I like it but they do have a lot of different formulas I think this one is just black or maybe it's very black. Here's a question I want to ask you. Sometimes they have the color as very black or blackest black. So which one is blacker? Very black or blackest black? Oh man, see I think I I hate it when you miss and then you don't miss all the way but just miss a little bit just to get some just to get some flakes on your skin. And then it's hard to get those off. So I just do a little bit on each side, not much, because I don't want too much clumping going on. I gotta do this when I do this, so just a little tiny bit on the bottom, not too much. I don't want a bunch of clumps. And there's that. And now for my lips, I just like a light nude color. This is the Wet n Wild, that one's a little bit nude. This one is the Revlon 651. What color is that? Pearl. No. Porcelain nude, I think. So just a little bit. I would use a lip liner and I had one, but I don't know what happened to it. So I'm not using that today, and then I put that on, and that's it. And that's my look for today. Thank you so much for watching. Get ready with me. We'll see you on our thrift store haul, hopefully, today. Bye, everybody. Okay, I'm going to do one more thing. 
I do have this liner from Physician's Formula, and I'm going to try to do a little bit of a wing on top, just a little. If I knew what I was doing, it would probably work pretty good. Yeah, that's just a tiny little wing. I just like baby bird wings. I don't want any eagle or hawk wings. Although they look beautiful on other people, but I'm afraid of them. So I'll have a hummingbird wing on mine. There, how's that? Okay, thanks everybody, bye.